are you? What film crew are you? We don't answer questions. Thank you. <laughs> you don't answer questions? You're here on my property. No, we're not. We're not. We're on public I'm easement. I'm asking you, like, why are you guys here? Why are you here? We're not on your property. We're on public easement. Why are you guys? How many people do you guys have in the hole? Why are you guys? How many times? How many people do you have in the hole? What is your point, guys? Are you guys armed? Are you armed? The public wants to know. The public wants to know. How many people are you guys have hiding in the hole? Why are you threatening us? Nobody's Why are you threatening, threatening us? Why are you guys threatening us? How are we threatening you? Why do you, do you, you have guns? No, do you, you have, have guns? guns on you? Do you have guns? You guys, why are you here? Do you have guns? Church of Scientology, folks. Why are you here? You guys have guns? Okay, you guys. Do these look like guns? Coming, you need to leave. We're not going to leave anywhere. Call public you photography. You don't say why you're here. You don't say your purpose. You I just asked you, how many doing. people do you have in the hole? You have no reason to be here whatsoever. I just asked you, how many people do you have in the hole? You have no reason to be here So you don't want to answer that? Whatsoever. Why not? What's your name? Yeah, Why don't you want to answer that question? What's your name? on public property. Yeah. How come we don't want to answer that question, ma'am? Where's Shelly Miscavige? There's people in the public that wants to know yeah, about what's going on. Answer the question. Here's the deal. Where you guys she? won't say who you are. Where is she? You won't Answer say why you're here. You won't say yeah, what you're doing. Yeah, we're here for the public, for public you're interest, because they want to know where Shally Miscavige is. Do you want to answer that question for the public? Over, but you don't even say who you are. You want to answer that for the public. You're hiding yourself. You've got on ski masks. You probably have guns. I don't have a gun. Wow. Oh, wow. A total that's wow, crowd. really? Oh, yeah. Wow, that is Look, a serious anybody accusation. Anybody going around in black the way you are? With you guys got all black on. Look at you. Look at you all dressed in black. Yourself. All of you are dressed yeah, in black. Yeah, look at you. Anyway, you're nine. supposed to be at church. Where's, you the Where's the well, greeting? Where's the greeting at? So no, you need to so tell us what you're doing. You guys are not going to say who you are. Answer the question. You're not going to say Where's the greeting? You guys are a cult. You guys are a cult. Okay, we're done. Answer you guys question. are a wicked cult. How many kids you got in there? How many kids yeah, you got? Talking, how many right? kids are you touching in there? How many kids are you touching in there? How many people are in the hole? They're all a bunch of cowards for hiding Shelly Miscavige. The people want to know where she is. That's a question. Where's Parker Rossman? Hey, you guys all got black on. You're all dressed in black, you saw. You guys got guns. You guys got guns. It's the First Amendment. Welcome to America. How many people are inside the hole? Where's Shelly Miscavige? And when we say the hole, we're not referring to Panama. Look at what we got here, guys. We got cops to our left side. Rolling up deep. Rolling up deep. You know they're all in the pocket with them. Oh no, that, that's because they're in the pockets with these guys. Scientology has them in the pockets. How you guys doing? We're doing uh, all right. Okay. Enjoying the I'll evening. I'll be right with you guys, okay? No, you won't. Just keep in mind that they don't tell the truth. Yeah, they came out here talking some weirdness. They like about they got a little, they got little kids the in, the in there touching them. All right, guys, so we got uh, the sheriff's department here. I don't know what happened, bro. I think the radio's down. No. Let me see. Oh, who is the uh, screen? Came off. Yeah, bro. How did that happen? Did you look right here? Here. Not you, it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> there we go. I got it. Yeah. When I did my audit here two years ago, that's the same cop that came out. All right, guys, so we have them on the scanner here.
dressed in all black. You saw it, guys. They kept dressed in all black. They all had cameras and flashlights and weapons. They wanted to interrogate us if we Something had flashlights to and weapons. They tried to hang us. told us we couldn't be Mark. here. And they wouldn't answer the question we came for, which is, where is Shelly Miscavige? Hey, guys, so we're at the... This is the Church of Scientology out here in Hemet, California. They actually uh, put hands on a protester. A protester was unarmed, he had no weapons on him. The security guards ran out and they put hands on him. And what else? Who's Shelly? Shelly what? Shelly Miscavige, he's the wife of the leader, Shelly Miscavige. She hasn't been seen in public uh, since 2007. Since 2007? Yeah, she's being she's being kept. She's being uh, kept away at a, a secret compound called Twin Peaks. Wow. I've audited there before. It's up in the mountain, like going up towards Big Bear. Oh, okay, okay. All right, guys. So, um, if you're tuning in, thank you for tuning in. If you guys seen how those security people came out, came out with cameras, but right before that, they had uh. They were getting all their night sticks ready to go. They wanted to come out here and give us a beat down. We're not your little average Joe. We're just gonna fucking take off and run. They are gonna try to lie. Yeah, Lone Wolf. So far, so good, bro. You guys stick around. Let's see what happens. If you've seen what happened right now, man, this lady came out from the PR and and uh, she was over here saying if we had guns on us and why are we in all black for? I got blue jeans on and a black sweater. And uh, if you guys seen that, then you see what happened. So now we have Riverside Sheriff's here. So I'm out here doing some backup work for uh, for the fellas right here. Decided to come out with them, meet them down here. We're gonna do some caught watching too. But yeah, here we are. And uh, that guard shack that you guys are looking at right there, that's a bunker. Nah, bro, no, I'm not alone, bro. I'm out here with SGV News First, West Coast Digital, and Nasty Nathaniel. So this guard shack right here, guys, is an actual bunker like they dumped a lot of money into this bunker just to have it built so they're nice and safe and secure in there all we're doing we're just out here with cameras you know they don't like that so in uh sgv was actually standing here where this uh squad car is at and this guy pulled into the parking lot so quick he almost hit him and uh he ended up dropping my um my uh this thing oh man it's broke he ended up dropping my uh my walkie-talkie and it's broke now so that was a pretty expensive walkie-talkie and that was no good whatever it's all for the cause anyway see broke so yeah we don't know where it's gonna go from here the cops are inside there talking to them right now. No telling what they're going to tell these cops. So, they're evil, man. These people are super evil. Right away they start, you know, trying to push the issue if we have guns. Yep, that's true. That's true, Lord Croft. I will, bro. Dylan. So, um, they actually have a hole. This is the main center. It's called the Golden Era Productions, right? And they have a hole right here where they actually keep people in that. So if you uh, mess up, and if you don't do something that they think you shouldn't have done, they'll put you in the hole. 
And as you guys heard, Nash Nathaniels said that uh, somebody came up missing from here and they got that person either hidden somewhere or they, they got rid of her. And then a couple years ago, there was a, an activist out here, a protester. He was protesting right here at the same gate. And some of the same security guards are inside of that booth. And those are the ones that, that end up jumping that guy. They put hands on him. They beat him with batons and everything. So this is more of a... Uh, a thing that Nasty Nathaniel likes to get involved in. So I'm out here to do some backup for these guys. If you guys seen that video I, I went to yesterday, I went to the Scientology yesterday because I kept hearing stories and I kept seeing videos about them not, you know, liking public photography. You know, anytime somebody comes around with the camera, boom. You know? So let's see what happens. You know, they're still inside that guard shack. Come over here with the guys, that way you guys can see who's all out here. Wait a minute, here they are. Hi guys. What's going on tonight? Do you guys have something to report? guys it's time to tell me so that I can address any concerns that you guys have. Yeah, we want to know where Shelly Miscavige is. Who? Shelly Miscavige. Shelly Miscavige? <coughs> Miscavige. David Miscavige's wife. She's been missing since 2007. Nobody knows where she is. Nobody's heard from her. She's been missing. Everybody wants to know where Shelly Miscavige is. How do you spell her last name? M-I-S-C-H-A-V-E. I-V-E, right? I think it's a M I S C A V I G E. Yeah. I'm sorry. I got the radio going off in my ear and the car's going by. I have M I S C H A V E. No, M I S C A G I V E. And what's her first name? Shelly? Shelly, yeah. How do you spell that? S H E L L Y. Do you know what her date of birth is? No, I don't. She's the leader, uh, she's the uh, yeah, wife of the, the leader, David Miscavige. Sure. The, lead, the, the leader of Scientology. I, I, don't, I don't know enough yeah. about it, man. She hasn't been seen in public since 2007. Okay, is she listed as a missing person? There's been, yeah. uh, oh, uh, yeah. Leah Remini uh, from the a &E series, she uh, has, has uh, filed a missing person report on her with the LAPD. And there's been some others, too, that have tried to do follow-ups. You're Nathaniel. We spoke once down there. Remember, you put me on the YouTube last time. Uh, remember? <laughs> you remember? Yeah, you got me. You see, you put me on YouTube. Last you guys time. ever going to turn the camera on yourself to show the tactical stuff that you're oh, wearing? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, well, all so, the time, man. You didn't do it on the last video. You made me yeah. look like look, I'm this look. something. This is, hey, this is on a live feed, no, man. No, we made you look good. And we're not we in tactical gear. Oh, I didn't you're do anything bad to you guys. Yeah, you guys got guns and everything. How how old is Shelly? Handcuffs. Does anybody know? She's got to be in her fifties. In her fifties. M I S C G I V No no M I S C A C A Vig B I G E B I G E Miss Cabbage I'm sorry man, can you write this down for me? I have to cover this because this is something that doesn't involve this. Okay, this is other people's private information and I would secure yours as well. And if it does come out, it's going to be a problem for you guys. Okay, that's not right. No, we're it's in the public, man. You need to I shut that shit your up. And, and you're the one that presented it. You want to be stupid, man. Asking to present that. We've been carrying ourselves with respect towards you. You start saying stuff like I'm that. Just, I'm just trying to give you guys... No, 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 no. No, you no exactly you're in the public, man. There's no expectation of privacy in the public. You got you anything exactly out here in the public, you, it could be recorded. What you did. Yeah, you you're trying to. You just set us up. You put private information in front of a camera, and then you asked us, you told us that we can't film that. So that was your mistake, youngster. You better learn the law. Okay. All right. How old is she? 50, you said? 
Yeah. That's some bullshit. What's your, bat, what's your ID number, sir? It's uh, 4810. And pronounce your name for me, please. You can read it. It's right here. No, you sir, tell the you judge that? I'm not going to pronounce it. Okay, if you can't read it, then you can't read it. Do you tell the judge that? Public servant? Is that correct? Servant. Yes, I'm correct, sir. Servant, get over here in service. Is that is that shithead? What, what did it say? Try to set us up right now. Try to set us up right now. Hey man, we're being respectful towards you, man. You don't have to be a little bitch. Yeah, you see? He tried to set us up right now. Saw that? <clears throat> yeah. Woo, called him out on that shit, huh? Yeah. So this guy handed Nasty Nathaniel uh, some paper to, you know, to sign, as you guys can see. And, uh, and he wants to look up at us talking about confidential, oh, you can, you can. private information. Yeah, that better not come out. You yeah, you're going to be in trouble. In front of a camera, he pulls it out and says it better not come out. Yeah, tyrant. Sucker. Dude. Straight up. Well, I thought he was dealing with some dummies out here. Hey, but ask them about that. They're not going to talk to me or him anymore, but ask them <laughs> where, what answer that they give him. Where shall we get? I don't know. Yeah. Today we want to know. They can't leave until they stop open an investigation. I'll give them my name. Mama. Yeah, they did, hippie. They did. Right. They were all in there getting their batons ready they to go. They already know you anyway, so. Yeah, they know. You can even talk to me. I have it on the main video. I only jumped on the live feed because uh, I was getting a little carried away. Man, that cop, that was something else, man. That cop tried to set us up right now. For sure, Lone Wolf. Yo, you guys stick around, man. You never know. This could turn south anytime. Anytime now, they could... Uh, you know, turn us off on us. And I really appreciate you guys joining in. Even if it's 16 people, man, I mean, on the other account, the main account, YouTube took my live feed from me, so I really appreciate you guys jumping in and having our backs out here, you know? What up, yo? SGB News first, we're out to find out where Shelly Miscavige is today. And the sheriffs are going to give us an answer. If not, we're going to make a report and we want an investigation done because she's been missing since 2007. So that's why we're here at the Gold Base today to investigate that. We've got four photographers. They said that we wouldn't put our, the cameras on ourselves, you know, but we're not doing anything on. All I have is my GoPro on my head. I got some glasses on for the bright lights they were shining at us. And so they wanted to come out and and they had gear just like us, dressed in all black, yep. they had all black on with bright lights, and they had cameras, they were filming us. 4K cameras, wide lens, us. everything. Yep. Yep. So, so this is what we came to expose today, and we want to know where Shelly Miscavige is. Yep. Hell yeah, good shit. So that was SGV news for us, guys. Lone Wolf said, what's up, Nasty? No. Yeah, he said, what's up, SGV and Nasty? Howdy. It was nasty, guys. <laughs> What's about to get pretty nasty here? Yeah, they got all mad, huh? They got pissed, bro. We caught them on their shit. Yep, yeah. yeah, the cops trying to set us up. Big they time. private information, put it right in front of a, a filming camera. They see all the red lights recording. They see all the bright lights on them, and they want to pull out personal information. Put it right in front of us and say, oh, you guys can't record that. Uh, if it comes out, you're going to be in trouble, you know, so he pretty much set us up to say. Yeah, he did. And we definitely called him out on him. Yeah. Told him to fuck off. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. That's what he did. That was yeah. dirty, man. Dirty. Dirty bastard. And he knows you. Yeah. He was, at, remember, I was just telling you, when I audited here two years ago, uh -huh. that was the same cop that came out. The same one? Yeah, that's the same one. Wow. Yeah, you should have Recognize your voice. Hey guys, um, 
I don't know if you guys have that option to do so, but if there's any way you guys could recommend this live feed to anybody else, recommend it, because we never know what could go down right now. The more, the merrier. This is the city of Hemet. This is uh, Gilman Hot Springs. Gilman Hot Springs. Yeah. Um, the Church of Scientology. We're right outside San Jacinto. Right outside of San Jacinto. Here they come, guys. Let's see if it's going to go south and what's going to happen. Failed to identify. We a remedy filed a report with the Los Angeles Police Department, there was a, so what, and there was an investigation. The way that it works, when we run somebody's name, I don't have their date of birth. It, plus or minus five years, right? Yeah. So if I don't know their date of birth, say if, if somebody's actual age is 45, for example, when we run someone's name with that with the age of 45, because we don't know their date of birth, mm -hmm. it goes everybody that has that same name that has a date of birth that would put them from either 40. To 45 to S C H M I T T. I can look it up right now. I'm sure. It, yeah, sure. Last well, I'm just name trying to make sure she's entered in. If that's the case, or, or there's a different variation on her spelling of her last name. Because oh, if, right if it wasn't, if it wasn't, if it wasn't done, I'll gladly do it for you. You guys don't have internet on your phone where you have to type in gentleman scavenging and give me the person's name. What, the what's her, that you gave, right? Hey guys, we're gonna need help spelling this young lady's name. We want this investigated. It's gone too long. Nasty. What's her name again? That way, some of the people could search it for us. Shelly Miss Cabbage. She's the wife of the leader. If you guys could look that name up for the proper spelling on it. That way, I could uh, let these cops know. And you're saying that she was. Listed as a missing person. At there was uh, Leah Remini filed a missing persons report. Okay. She's the the star that the the A &E series Scientology in the aftermath. Okay. She filed a missing persons report with the Los Angeles Police Department. Okay. And supposedly, uh, a detective made contact with her. Yep. And the only thing that they were told was that, that oh, the the investigations, you know, blah blah blah. We talked to her. She's fine. Okay. I'm, sl and there was I'm no slowly more. I'm slowly learning through this. That's the proper spelling of it. Well, she's not going to show up if she's not missed it. It sounds like they did the investigation, and because they contacted her and spoke with her, they would, if she was entered, but it, they it was would remove her. It was, it was never confirmed. You know, they, they never... They, they try to do public records requests and find out. Hey, good looking out, Lone Wolf. Interview. Thank you. Outside the presence of other Scientologists, there was never the, any information I mean, my given. My suggestion would be go back to LAPD and talk to them regarding their records on that call for service. Well, no, I mean, people have it, and they've denied all the all the, the FOIA requests. And I mean, you have to go through the Public Information Act as far as Michelle. finding out what you can and can't. M I S C A V I G E. Is it that right? And you got her at age 50, correct? Yeah. yeah oh, okay, so Shelly is her, so that's a nickname. Oh, Diane that's a nickname. Discovered. Hey, that's Boomer, her. how are you? Oh, so her name is Michelle, it's not yes, Shelly. Yeah. Oh, that, no. that would probably See, be that's what comes Yeah, right. thank you guys, I appreciate it. Michelle. Lone Wash, Lone, uh, Lone Wolf. Thank you, brother. I'm not used to having so many lights. You got an important see. job to do, you man. It's just, mind. you got an important job to do. We're not into disrespecting you guys, no, man, I, I but you, man. you failed to identify. And I don't, I don't get that. That's uh, your policy. Was, hey, you know what? My mistake. I'm not trying to start any ways with you guys. You ready to end. identify then? Huh? You ready to identify? I, I already told you who I was. What, what is your name, sir? Right here. No, can you say it? That way the people can it's see? It's like the bad word, but there's an M in there. Okay. And your badge number? I already told you that. 
I didn't get it. I told you that. Did I not say that already? He knows. Oh, you got it? Nathaniel, you heard me tell him my badge number already. Actually, some of my badge numbers my ID. Just, why are you so prideful, man? It's just a badge number. And then the birthday, January 18, 1961. Better known as Shelly, the wife of the Church of Scientology's leader, David Miscavige. That's the leader. He lives here. She was last seen publicly in August of 2007. Now, Nathaniel, so, you were saying that that Los Angeles Police Department spoke with her? Yeah, what happened was they, uh, Leah Remini went to do a follow up on it to find out what was going on. And the only thing she was told was that. Oh yeah, we sent somebody to talk to her, and when she tried to find out more information, was was she interviewed privately outside the presence of other Scientologists? Have you guys no contacted LAPD to see if you get a copy of their report? Should be, I think, it, public information. Well, oh yeah, certain yeah. Things are, certain things are. There, there's a, there's been multiple, not just by 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 us, but by other other people have done multiple FOIA requests, and every everything's been denied. You know, okay. the the only so it's just it's like it's just it's like this. You know, we just have to keep drawing more attention so to get. If she's not in yeah, the we're good. person's database, then it's because they ruled that she's not missing. It'll say no because records they found. they haven't reported her. You need to understand, they have not reported her missing. So we need to know if they're the ones that are keeping her from the public. Do you have reason to believe that she's here? We just want to know where she is. She's been oh, I'd love to know where she is, too, so I could bring her right here and we could all have... It's believed that she's being kept at a location called Twin Peaks. Where's Twin Peaks? It's, it's in... Uh, um, up the uh, San Bernardino Mountains, like going so, up towards Big Bear. Then why are we here? Huh? Because this is their international headquarters. This is where... Have you guys been to Twin Peaks? Huh? Yeah. Did, did you guys have been to Twin No. You know what? I forget who has a tool. Yeah, we make contact with the... As an um, admin on my channel, but do not so remove we, comments we, on my we, channel, please. So this is... So what, you know, what are you thinking that they're going to tell you? Well, when you're trying to get out information, I mean, you go to the top of the mountain, you know. I mean, this is the this is the mothership. So we're trying to, you know, you see get their attention. Film crew that came out? Was the film crew still in there? Oh, well, they had a No, I know, I know, bro. Guys, just like us, dressed in all black, came out with cameras, lights, everything. They were flashing us, getting the camera all up in our face, you know, trying to get all our pictures, intimidating us. Well, I know the feeling. It's happened to me right now. Yeah, no, no, but but you're saying that we look crazy because we're all dressed like crazy. in... No, I just I was no, asking him why he looks like, so tactical no, no, at the time I see him. There was like <laughs> four of him. Four of him and another woman came out, the spokesperson. She came out and talked to us, and they were all up in our face. Yeah, we didn't do that. I mean, they got like... I mean, this is were you nothing. scared? This is no, of course not. This is nothing for four guys to be here filming them. They were ready for it. They brought out four of their own. Were you... Were you did you feel threatened? Just like, just like, uh, no, oh, man. Yeah, I mean, they were like, I didn't. Up in just our because face. of the way they were dressed? The, the first security guard, the they obviously the felt like that. In our face, and then, uh, you know, bumping my camera, and then, you know, I told him if he touches me again, I was going to take him down. You know, so then he backed up, obviously, and he went away, and then that's when these other film guys came out. Did you ever out. call the police? Huh? Why didn't you call the police? No, because you guys never do anything. Unfortunately, you guys, I mean, not you guys, but police have a bad uh, reputation when it comes to making reports on, on assaults, batteries. But we don't know if you don't call. I, I read, uh, man, I, this camera alone has been hit about four or five times. And I, I try to make a report and everybody just walks away because there was no damage. I mean, even if you go like this, there's no damage. But I'll tell you this much. If, you're, if you say that you're, you're being intimidated, that you're... You're feeling threatened. Yeah. Then it's becoming upon that person to say, "Hey, you know what? I'm going to remove myself from this situation because I'm legitimately afraid." Right. Well, I mean, instead of standing there, and we can't. Your ground, we can't separate though. We're all standing there together because we're stronger. Enough. Yes, we're ancient hippie. One 58. at a time. You know, we're we're in trouble. If one of us. Hey, thank you, Sam. No hey, one's forcing you guys yeah. to be here in the first place. No, no. exactly. So but they came like, out onto the public easement. You know where they have no business coming out. No, oh, it, sure it, it, look, it don't matter. I don't. I don't yeah, care yeah, if they, they come out, dude. That's fine. That's fine. We don't care. We're just looking for that, that, that person. Yeah. Has anyone told you not to film? Yeah, no, Obama. You notice that? Actually, told us to go away. Yeah, she tried to leave. Yeah. And that's what I meant when yeah. I said they so got no this, business coming out here. So you guys know. I spoke yeah, to them. We know. We know. We know. This exactly. line right here. Yeah, yeah. You guys can cross the line. You want to yeah. film? Great. Now, if a car is coming in, right. you guys are not clearly visible. You're wearing all dark What about you, sir? What's your name, sir? Sergeant. Sergeant, right? 
Corporal. Corporal, I'm sorry. What's your name, sir? Corporal okay. Abel. Abel. And your badge Sheriff number? Sheriff ID 2329. 2329. Thank you, sir. And that's how it's done. That's a, this is a professional right here. Someone told me once, just because you can do something doesn't no, no, no. mean you should. We're not saying that we're going to walk like criminals. I personally wouldn't use that I'm not as an excuse do this as, to as walk in front of the street <laughs> and say, well, I have the right-of-way, so the car No, of course. Stop. I have the right-of-way. I'm the pedestrian. Right? I'm walking on the street. You need to wait till your but, vehicle. But if you're walking stop in your the... vehicle and wait for me to clear so that you can enter. But if you're walking the in the street, though, if you're walking in the street. Yep. Lone Wolf, that's it. You were talking about street. Yeah, I know he is. So this isn't the street. No, no, we're, we're walking, this is a public, public easement. I also have a public easement. Well, generally, you wouldn't want to, because it's not safe. Generally, people park here if they're walking down or something. Walking down the street. Well, in any case, this is what I'm going to do for you guys, okay? I will follow up with this with LAPD and establish whether their investigation revealed that she was or was not put in the missing persons database. In order for me to complete that investigation, one of you needs to give me your information so that I can say that I spoke to you. Otherwise, it's not a complete investigation. That's a lie. I can't say I met a random person that doesn't want to tell me who he is that's claiming that this person's missing. I need to conduct a thorough investigation. Are you willing? Does anybody here? You don't have to give me your info, but it's going to hurt the investigation. If you really care, one of you will come forward and tell me who you are. At least one of you. Well, you already know who one of us is. I know Nathaniel. I don't know his All right, there it is. I don't know his date of birth. I need that. You don't need to know nothing else. You know? Just like no, you guys don't know my first name, you know what I mean? Yeah. Anonymous report. I, I, but I need, I need you're, details. You're, once you look at the name, once you look at the investigation, you're going to see that there this is. This guy needs to run for sheriff. I like him. There's a definitely open investigation, man. That's all you need. Okay. All right. Well, let us try running the person again, and we'll see what we can thank find you. out. Right, we appreciate okay, thank you. You got the address. I mean, you got everything. You got everything you need. Everything you have to do. You have it. I have the last name and the first name of the data. So you, you know, you know, real quick. I mean, I know, you know, uh, when I was here two years ago. I mean, you, you know, yeah, it's I know raining you, that day, right over there. Yeah, up the road when it was raining and crazy, but. You know, uh, I know you said that during that time when we spoke, you know, that, oh, they've helped you guys solve a lot of crime and all that. But but seriously, I mean, you know, I don't know how interested you are. You should really, I mean, it's a Google search. Look up the Scientology, Shelley Miscavige, Scientology gold Base BD. You know, I mean, they, that's what I meant earlier when I said they don't have any business coming out on public property because they came out here and assaulted protesters and reporters and things. And this, this stuff has been documented. It's been well documented. Like I said, it's a, it's a simple Google search, you know, if you really want to. You know, they've, they've done a lot of, you know, they've been very hostile. I mean, he's been assaulted, I've been assaulted, you know, they, they do a lot of bad things. That's why we, we come, come in numbers, you know. They come out and they, they come out to push bully and intimidate so that we can do something to them, so they have something to report that we came here or whatever, and we got physical, but yeah. we're not about that. We're not about I would say and causing problems. I see we where you're coming. Want we but I would answers. also say there's a B-side to it. If you know that it's going to be a problem, then don't put yourself in that position. No, kind of wanted to talk to somebody. That's the problem. But well, we don't want to go the property. Sometimes we people don't respond. I mean, we live in a country where we have the right to remain silent. Okay, so right? that was a public figure. And I'm looking into that for you, right? Now it's now missing for how long? Sure, so there are people that have been missing for years. Okay, well, let's find out where Shelly is, please. Thank you. People want to know. I don't think I have Even her closest friends. Do you understand that not everybody's aware of it? I wasn't even aware of it. Yeah, well, I have no idea. Maybe you're disconnected from what happens in the public because there's a lot going on there. Yeah, I know. I know, DW Kemp. Well, let me follow up with it. We'll see where we're at. Okay. If When I come back, I'll tell you what I found. If it turns out that she was never reported as missing, or she's just not listed as missing person, whatever, I will contact LAPD on your behalf. And hey guys, you. real quick, while I have yeah, you guys on this live feed. Can you tell us what's going on with this investigation? Because we're having some problems. I understand. Hold on, I'll tell you guys right now. Hold on. I'm not denying you, you guys. You're called for service. I'm glad they helped you. That's what I'm here for. We appreciate it. I just want to keep the peace. That's all. Yeah. Okay, appreciate cool. It. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so um, you guys just heard that, right? A lot of cops planning going on, obviously. But uh, while I have you guys on this live feed, I want to let you guys know something really quick. Uh, somebody either created a, 
a YouTube channel exactly like mine or they hacked into my account like I put on my community update a few of you guys seen that update uh, whoever that is they're going around writing freaking crazy messages to certain auditors it's like they're pinpointing which ones they could uh I don't know it's crazy it's like they're pinpointing who they could write this crap to Lone Wolf said that somebody wrote him and said something about filming my ass when he comes down here and you know, jokingly, I sat there and told him, well, make sure, you know, I'm going to shave it first. <laughs> but, no, on a serious note, somebody has been writing some pretty scandalous stuff to, uh... Oh, okay, all right, DWK, to, uh, you know, different auditors and cop watchers. And I changed my password on my uh, YouTube channel, so... I have a feeling I know who's doing it. I don't want to come right, like, right out and say it yet until I have 100% proof. And as soon as I have that proof, then I'm going to share it with you guys. That way you guys know that this certain person is a dirtbag. Straight up. So, uh, yeah, guys. So, I don't know if I should keep the live feed going or if I should just go ahead and... So did... I'm um, no thanks. What? What do you mean? What do you mean, Laura? Lori? What do you mean? What was it? What? What? Tell me. What are you guys talking about? I want to know now. What is it? <laughs> what happened? You guys said you seen something on um no thanks. Yeah, no. Yeah, you know what, bro? I think I know who's doing it, big dog. I really do. I really think I know who is doing that. Ah man, I want to I want to put it out there so bad right now, but let me let me get my proof together, man. You know that's what we dig for. You know we dig for truth, and you know I'm gonna dig for truth, and I'm gonna find out who did that. And I know it's somebody who's involved with auditing. I know that for a fact. I know that for a fact, guys. So if you guys see some crazy, crazy stuff, somebody writing some random stuff, man, just Either click on that channel, if it looks like mine, see where it takes you to. Or just get a hold of me, like, hey, you know, it's still happening, whatever. I don't know what else to do because I changed my password already on my YouTube channel, so. And I put a super long password on this bad boy this time, so it shouldn't happen again. So anything that came in probably had to have been from last week or so because I changed it. That's when everything started coming in. But... Trust and believe, guys, as soon as I get the proof. Oh, you know what? I think you do know who it is, Lone Wolf. All right, brother, so DWK, it's awatchman40 at gmail.com. awatchman40 at gmail.com is my email if anybody wants to get a hold of me. If not, uh, I don't know, he just said something about it wasn't working. Leave me your email, and I'll shoot it right back to you. Or you know what? Take down my number here, man. I don't care. It's 661-674-7364. If anybody wants to contact me, just chit-chat for a little bit. Shoot the shit. Go ahead. Lone Wolf, I, you know what, bro? I'm pretty sure you know who it is, too, bro. I'm pretty sure you understand what I'm trying to say, though, too. Like, I don't want to put that put that person out yet, all the way out, until I have that 100% proof, bro. You say it. <laughs> Let me get the proof, bro. Yeah, yeah, we got to make sure, bro. So as soon as we get that, then, yeah, it's going to get out there. All right, guys, so it's 661-674-7364. Six, six, that's my personal cell phone number. If anybody wants to get a hold of me on there, feel free to do so. All right, I'm going to go ahead and cut the live feed, guys. Thank you. I appreciate you guys very much. Much love, loyalty, honor, and respect.